What? Oh, it's just, I have the funniest story. I mean, you are not going to believe this, but, um, car has been found. It has been retrieved. Really? That's great. They caught the guy? Well, kind of. This is actually the funny part. That is also a really good sign for humanity, actually. Um, it was never stolen. I just left it in the back and forgot. <laughs> what? It's not my fault, Mike. It wasn't where I usually park it. See, I just pulled around the back to drop off the coffee urn, which was not part of my usual routine. Are you kidding? It's been there the whole week? How could you not know where you parked your car? Because I always park in the front. Oh, my God. That is hilarious. Wait, are you here again, Axel? Shouldn't you be studying? Wait, what happened? Oh, did you find your car? Who stole it? It was an inside job. Very inside. I don't think it matters who stole it or if it got stolen or what happened. The important thing is we got it back and people are good at heart. I mean, that's what we should be focusing on. So you're telling me I spent every lunch this week filing police reports and digging out insurance papers and you just forgot where you parked it? That's mom for you. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, my God, you forget everything. I do not. Really? How about the time you couldn't find your phone and it turns out you were just talking on it? He's right, Mom. You did do that. Movies! She can never remember the names of any movies she sees. That is completely untrue. Mike, tell him. We were just talking about movies yesterday. The one with the actress who adopted the African-American baby, but not Charlize Theron, the one before her, is not technically the name of a movie. Face it, Dad. Her brain's cheese. Maybe she should get a CAT scan. I am not getting a CAT scan. Oh, actually, Mom, that's not a bad idea. Last week, you left the groceries on the stoop all night long. From what Myrtle says about her sister Edna, once they start, it's a slippery slope till they go. Mm. Oh, my God. That'll be so sad. Dad's going to fall apart. Oh, I'll be all right. Yeah, Dad'll be fine. I know some lovely widows that would be all over that action. He's not going for one of your biddies, Brick. He's going to have a lot of options. Ooh, maybe he'll bring in someone to take care of us and then he'll fall in love with her like Maria in The Sound of Music. And hey, maybe she'll actually be able to cook. Our bodies would probably go into shock at first, but that'd be great. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's enough. Frankie, even if your mind is totally shot, I promise I'm not marrying anybody. I'm probably just going to want to date around for a while. <laughs> <laughs>